Hi everyone, welcome back. We continue on this list and today we are going to learn about sort function. You can easily understand from the name also this function help us to order, to sort the each row and each column of a matrix or an image or we can call. Uh, it's just basically doing this. But why we need this function? For example, you need to find a specific pixel in an image or you need to find pixel groups in an image. So in that case, before starting your search algorithm, you can apply this sort function at the beginning. So it's gonna sort the image, sort the matrix. At the end of the operation, you can uh, apply your search algorithm, for example, binary search maybe. So it's gonna be more efficient. Also, it's gonna be more uh, faster. So uh, applying this function at the beginning is gonna help you in that case. Also, this can be used for some algorithm optimization or some statistical analysis. Also, applying medium filter or kind of filters uh, after this function output uh, to the destination output, applying those kind of uh, algorithms is gonna be more efficient. So that's why in some cases we can need this function. Okay. Uh, the usage is very simple, uh, basically you are just giving your source and the destination images and also uh, one more thing maybe we need to um, focus on this sort flex, we need to specify sort flex because according to this it's gonna sort the image, sort the matrix, okay. And the this one and this one just specifying the which one you want to sort, uh, the row or the column, you need to specify this one and after that ascending or descending. Um, uh, the the row or uh, column you are choosing wh which order according to what we need to sort so ascending is gonna uh, just in the ascending order or descending order accordingly let's switch to the code part and understand more clearly how this function is working this is the code from the previous video um, we can delete this one and uh, let's apply an image 3 by 3 um, let's say 4 uh, let's say 7 or little higher numbers 40 10 77 and let's say 33 okay uh, also you need to little more maybe this is how many now three six seven okay I think now we have our three by three matrix and uh, I'm gonna im show them at the end okay I need an output here now we can call our function which is sort function and okay input output and our flex which is sort for example let's start with the row so I want to um, sort the row but after that uh, it doesn't know it should be ascending or the descending if I'm not wrong the default one is just um, ascending one let's try and see the result so basically it will just give me the output and we are gonna see with the im show. Okay, this is my output, this is my input. So we specified the row, uh, it start with 10 and then 40, then 77. So it's the ascending one, the, uh, the default one is the ascending flag, okay. But if I want the row in the descending um, order, how it's gonna work, just you need to apply one more enumerator which is um, descending one so in this case it's gonna uh, apply accordingly okay now previously it starts with the 10 now it starts with the biggest number in the row 77 40 and 10 accordingly in here also same works 122 is the biggest one start with that one and finish with the 7 which is the smallest one okay um, similarly it's also work for um, column let's try this one I expect each column start uh, from the biggest one yes this is 122 it start with 122 because in the column this is the biggest one in here the biggest one is 99 so it start with 99 and continue accordingly similarly in the first row also um, start with 40 yeah so the usage is very easy right yeah just um like this you, 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 are, you can apply easily uh, let's try with the real image I'm just curious how it's gonna looks like my input this one okay let's try with Lena image I have some assumptions how it looks like um, okay oh this is cannot be applied then to the grayscale images there is a warning in there okay just single channel array so what we need to do is just 
simply give me the grayscale im read grayscale now it's gonna work okay so we are not surprised because what it's doing is just okay here um, in above it's you can see the pixel value from this L it start with the highest values in the column and continue according to the lowest one so it's a little um, looks like interesting but uh, in some way also looks beautiful yeah okay for this video i just want to to simply talk about this sort function um see you in the next videos